welcome people to parse walls and no nonsense comparisons today we are looking at laptops which are in the range of 50000 as work from home has become a new norm laptop sales have uh, boomed a lot from past few months be it, be it a college goer or be it a professional or be it somebody who is into an entry level gaming uh, the following laptops are the best for our comparisons, we have selected these prominent features and have tried to get a balance amongst all. The laptops do not lean into a hardcore gaming configurations nor, nor into something which is very very basic. Uh, they strike the exact balance between uh, the usability, the entertainment factor and also graphic intensive work. The features include uh, a screen size, uh, the display FHD, UHD, the operating system, the processor, the SSD used the HDD, the RAM, the graphics card, and the price. The first laptop in the series is ASUS X409JA. The laptop features a 14-inch FHD display with Nano Edge. The bezels are very very small which makes the screen look very elegant. The screen also has 175 degree viewing angle and a matte glare coating definitely reduces any strain on your eyes because of the glare. The laptop comes with Windows 10 operating system, a home operating system which is the latest and also comes with Intel i5 10th generation processor. It has got sufficient juice and, and power to, uh, for your regular activities. 8GB RAM, definitely multitasking should be water smooth. 512GB SSD ensures the laptop, uh, you know, boot, boot speed of the laptop is, is comparatively fast. And then there are there are actually two variants of this laptop one with the graphics card and one without the graphics card the without variant features mx250 and video graphics card uh, additional few thousand rupees the laptop comes in four pc colors transparent silver slate gray peacock blue and row uh, personally i feel i feel the slate gray color looks very elegant so i i would go for it the weight of the laptop is around 1.66 kilograms so it's around the heavier side when compared to all the other uh, laptops in the list. Audio quality is pretty good as we have uh, Asus Sonic Master inbuilt. There's also a fingerprint sensor and I mean just for the extra safety. So the cost varies at around 50,000 rupees for the non-graphics card variant and maybe few thousands for the gra few thousands more for the graphics card variant. Let's roll on to the next. The second laptop in the series is ASUS VivoBook 15, another visually stunning laptop with a 15.6 inch full HD display, nano edge small bezel screen. I mean I would definitely go for the red one, red looks the best. The laptop comes with Windows 15 Home OS, the processor is Intel 11 Gen i5 which is, which is like the second best Intel i5 processor currently. The drawback of this laptop, again, uh, it does not come with an SSD, so expect a little bit of delay in your booting. But the 1 TB HDD makes up for the speed in terms of the volume. So if you can avoid buying extra space, uh, I mean if you want to avoid buying extra space in Google Drive, definitely this is the option that you have to go for. The laptop comes with 8GB RAM, hence multitasking should be smooth. As similar to the previous laptops, this laptop also comes with two variants without the graphics card and with MX330 NVIDIA GeForce graphics card variant. The overall cost of the former variant is 47,000 and the overall cost of the later could be a few thousand more. If you are someone who, who does video editing, photo editing, little bit of gaming, and definitely go with the graphics card option because th that helps you in your day-to-day uh, -day activities. Also these laptops have fingerprint sensors and an antibacterial protection for keyboard. I am not very well convinced why we need an antibacterial keyboard but anyways if it has antibacterial coating then definitely go with it. Let's load for the next one in the series and let's see what features it has. The next machine that we see is MI Horizon 14. As we all know MI provides value for the money. Here we have another such device. Uh, the laptop was a 14 inch full HD display with 91% screen to body ratio. Amazing. I mean, this is the best screen to body ratio that you see in, 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 these, in these laptops in the series. It comes with Windows 10 home operating system. 
uh, also and when it comes to the CPU uh, the laptop has got the best i5 11 gen processor so definitely uh, combine combine it with the 8 GB RAM it has definitely the applications will run faster when compared to the other laptops 512 GB SSD ensures faster boot speeds and compared to HDDs uh, speaking of HDDs again sadly we don't have one at this laptop so if you're somebody who is a storage freak and wants to store all the movies that you've watched in a year of streaming uh, you would have to buy a separate external hard disk nvidia geforce mx350 comes attached so definitely a good option for photographers videographers and beginner level gamers large cooling vents are also provided so that there is this less heating when when you have longer sessions stereo speakers with dts audio processing and 0 to 50 percent in 35 minutes this is something good 0 to 50 percent in 35 minutes uh, are like added benefits the laptop is very very light it's just 1.35 kilograms the lightest in the series the overall price of the laptop is moderately placed at around uh, 54,000 rupees. Yeah, that, that, that hits this part. Let's check out the next model. Next laptop what we have is Asus Aspire 5. Uh, it has 15.6 inch screen with full HD display. Definitely a yes from my side for good movie experience. And also Acer color intelligence which comes inbuilt and shows stunning visuals every time. Windows 10 home operating system markets best i5 11 gen processor, 8 GB RAM, 512 GB SSD definitely ensures faster uh, application booting and task execution. The best feature of the laptop is Wi-Fi 6 definitely uh, which, is, which is very much essential these days you know for faster communication and data transfers. Similar to MI Horizon, uh, we don't see a hard disk here, so depending upon the requirement, uh, one may have to buy an external drive or one may have to buy a little bit more space on Google Drive. Uh, the SSD uh, can be pushed up to 1 TB and HDD up to 2 GB if required at additional cost. The laptops are available in, in many colors and sound quality is also very good because as, as, as we have Acer Pro Harmony inbuilt, uh, the sound quality seems very nice. Let's, let's check out the next uh, in the series. last but not the least hp 14 as intel build the laptop features a 14 inch full hd display with windows 10 home operating system the power of the laptop is again i5 11 gen the best and the 8 gb ram the combination definitely ensures top speed and efficient multitasking between your applications uh, similar to the previous laptop to ensure faster boot speeds we have 512 gb ssd drive but again no HDD for storage. The PCLE based SSD storage definitely is much faster when compared to the uh, HDD. So uh, one thing guaranteed boot speed should 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 be very low. The laptop has backlit keyboard, good for working in low light area. It also features long battery life and fast charging. This sums up the list for now. I will be making another video in a few months and will be updating the models accordingly. Follow my channel, subscribe and like if you are into tech and would love to get latest information and comparisons. This is the best channel. I also have a Hindi and Kannada version of these videos so that it helps more people in choosing the best for their money. This is Parseval and you are watching Parseval's No Nonsense Comparisons. Ciao.